Then we have to think about who's getting recognized. In this case, Joanna Lee in the early mid 1970s is the first female to win her Emmy Award for a drama, right? We have Triva winning for a comedy. Just about eight years later, Joanna Lee is gonna win for the Thanksgiving episode of The Waltons. She had been an actress in the 40s and uh, had had sadly a car accident which made it difficult for her to perform and be on set for long hours. So she turned to writing. She became a television writer, working on all of these many shows, right? All the way through. Um, and it's interesting to see how she went from comedies. We always think girls have to be funny first. And then she started to do dramas, right? The Mod Squad and then moved into Dynasty. But she got her Emmy Award for the Waltons. So this is a huge moment. Again, a female winning this award on her own. That's a big deal. Outside of that, are there women of color in early television? Not as many as we would like, as is always the case. However, Madeline Anderson came up through the news business, right? She started doing a black journal out of Chicago originally, and then she got uh, uh, jobs on Sesame Street. So through the PBS network, she started working for them doing children's programming and the electric company, always things with an educational bent. She's the first African-American woman who ever produced a nationally aired television series also on PBS also an educational series. So Madeline Anderson is someone whose name does not appear in most of our history books. And that's always been a problem for me. 